Oh, yeah, that's his stuff. Okay, I was like, when did I get an iron sword? Staff of courage. I think it's junk. No. Oh, a bit of this. Not what I meant to do. That. Come here. Emulator of Gabella. I'm really never going to use that, so. Sell that along with the silver. I sell pretty much all of the potions except for the ones that um, directly restore something. So there we go, we emptied out Balthor's gold, which is Dude, good. Oh hey, let's I uh need so we'll a bit of this out. and a bit of that. That would be pretty useful to have, but I don't well, yeah, I'm, I could get the funds for it, but I don't want to right now. I just hope we need to have, like, a ring of destruction or Remember, something. Remember, I'll give you the best. That would be really, really useful to have. But hopefully when we go visit the, uh, Mages College, they will have just about everything that we need. Okay, so we need to find, uh, let's find Amrin. Yeah. Just follow the arrow. It looks like you might be up at Dragon's Reach, which would be terribly convenient for us. Because that's where we have to go to turn in the uh, quest for killing the other bandits. So, yeah, looks like he's in Dragon Reach. What Amron's doing up here is beyond me, but whatever. I'm not going to complain about it. If I do start pickpocketing, which I just remembered I mentioned before, to get the uh, extra 100 carrying capacity, then I'm probably going to end up having to start the Thieves Guild quest, just because um, that's how you unlock the fence. He's above me. Uh, that's how you unlock the fence, which is the person that you sell the stolen items to. Um, because you can't sell stolen items to normal vendors. You tried mercy. Got your Found sword. Thank He's you. gonna train us with one-handed weapons had a and block, sword and shield technique. which teach it to you. are useless as far as like, our uh, the skills we're gonna be I using. I Jarl Baldo. Excellent. Killed the man leader. He gives service. us 100 gold. Here is your reward. No more work off of right now. Uh, let's talk to Faringar. Absurd that you can't just go to sweet world. Yeah, shut up. I hate the little children. He has no dragons reach to these. So you wish to master the What have you got for sale? I already have novice rooms of destruction, so spell tomes are the same. Miscellaneous, I'm not interested. Oh, here we go. Uh, he buys books. Forgot about that. Oh, we forgot to go get to the treasure. Okay. Keep the soul gems. You know, if you've got the aptitude. I'm gonna go get that treasure now. And then after we pick up the treasure. Oh, actually, oh, am I gonna have to stop back? No, I'm not. After we go get the treasure, I'm going to go to the Mage's College. Where'd Faringar go? He was just here. Hey. There you are. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Where can I learn more about magic? Student, are you? Well, I'm afraid there you I'm go. Much now we have a quest to visit the College of Winter. Do do do. do. Alright, let's go get that treasure really quickly. It's not a very far run. It's just uh, one fast travel and then a little trek across uh, a little trek across land and we're good to go. I've been thinking about live streaming for quite some time now, but the issue is I'm not sure if my internet here at college would support that. Uh, and the problem is the connection speed is good here but we have limits on our bandwidth usage and I already use up a lot of my upload. Upload our limit is five gigabytes and I use about half of that each day just uploading my videos. So if I were to live stream I'm pretty sure that would use upload as well and uh, then that wouldn't really be a, a significant possibility so I'm gonna look into that but <coughs> I wish I could. I mean I think it's something I would really enjoy because I love the uh, the interactions with people. And, you know, YouTube is great, but you don't get instant feedback from YouTube. You get you know a comment here or there, a like here or there, but 
nothing like the sort of thing you would receive from live streaming, which I've done some live streams in the past, but it's been other games, uh, usually not as high res, so that would be the difference. For that to load, and then we're good to go. So, what I'm going to show you now is the treasure map. Which, if you will notice where I'm standing, you see that windmill? I can't point to it because my cursor's gone, but you see the windmill? Look at the angle of the blades and then the fence in front. So we are right here, and the location is actually up behind that crag on the mountainside. So we're going to march our way on up there. Basically just go around that spur right there, and then uh, we're going to head to the left, which I think in this case is west, but no big deal. Um, my tip to anyone who's trying to climb like a mountain or something, if you get to a part that you can't just jump up, run side to side and then try jumping up it. Because uh, as you're running to the side, you stay even with where you were, and then if you find a, if you just hit space and keep jumping, if you find a place where you can jump, it'll lever you up and then you can move back. All right, so the chest should be in these bushes here. Yep. See, I've been here before, so I knew where that was. Elven boots. Those are nice. I'll probably throw those on. Amethyst, gold, ironing guy. Gold ruby necklace. Alright, so that wasn't bad at all. Actually, it ended up being worth a lot more than I thought it would be. Let's put on those elven boots so I do not forget. Much better than imperial white boots, which we're just going to toss. Alright, now we're going to go to Whiterun Stables. Um, the reason for this is because we're headed off to Winterhold, and I don't know if I mentioned this before, I don't think I did because I didn't know about it when I actually did my first recording. I just found out about this a couple of days ago. Um, if you talk to the person who has the carriage out in front of Whiterun Stables, they will offer to bring you anywhere to any of the main holds in the Empire for a fee anywhere between 20 and 50 gold, so it's not that expensive. And uh, it saves you a shit ton of traveling on foot. I have a level 40 character, and um, all of the traveling to the different like wide cities and everything I did on foot because I had no idea about this carriage. Um, and I did some on a horse, but my horse died, so <laughs> that was a little sad. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? All right, so we're going to Winterhold. Climb 50 gold, back. understandable because it is all the way across the map. I'll show you really quickly where it is. So we're here in White Run, and Winterhold is up there. Like way the hell out there, so fifty so gold is an understandable feed. Kajit, I think they call themselves. <coughs> the Kajit or Kajit, whatever they are, um, have been my staple like character that I played through on most of the past Elder Scrolls series, um, and by the past I mean the third and the fourth. I never played the first or second. Um, and the reason for that is because of their stealth. And I, I was always interested in playing the stealth character whenever the possibility presented itself. And I think, uh, in particular, Skyrim does a really, really good job of making a stealthy character be a possibility. And right now, uh, my level 40 is, I would say, a warrior playthrough more so than anything else. Um, but I have leveled up his sneak and pickpocket and everything, and I'm doing the thieves guild quest the right now. I'm really enjoying it. And the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. Okay, so oh, most will you kind of have to play it so carefully at this point. This is the college of Winterhold. She's a biatch. A safe haven for me. Say magic Perhaps. college. But what is it you expect to find with? Okay, so do not choose this first option. I'm pretty sure that's bad. Also, second one bad. This one. Probably okay. That one also probably okay. I went with this one the first time I came in, so I'm gonna pick ah, that again. The immortal plane. It would seem that the She's college like, has what you seek. Not just anyone is a, a small test. Small test. 
don't try to persuade her. It won't work. So. Excellent. A standard spell for one skilled in destruction Firebolt. magic is the firebolt. Ca I can cast I look the firebolt. Forward to it. Well done. I think you'll be. As I'll lead you across the. Yeah, the, uh, the spell that Once she you're inside, you'll want to offers. Well done. For you to, s to cast, I think is random. I'm not 100 percent sure on that, but. See, I think she has to like deactivate these or something, or activate them before I can pass, or not. She casts like some sort of spell as she passes each one of these, so. We're just not gonna follow her, we're gonna sprint ahead. Um, the spell that she has you cast, I think, is random, or it varies depending on, uh, who your character is. So, for my main character, it was like a simple illusion spell, just because I didn't have any magic. Um, and I didn't know the spell, so if you don't know the spell, she offers to sell it to you for 30 gold. You may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? See, she gives you novice and novice robes of destruction. Wonderful. Please. Which, uh, I was not <laughs> really... Well, I, I knew that, but I didn't think about that before I bought these for myself. Yes, so. don't wander well, off. I bought that novice I'm robes of destruction that I was we picked up in, in the introduction. Of so. of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the hall, and the Archmage's quarters above the Try not to interrupt too much in this dialogue. While technically in charge of the college, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Okay, Dad. Unfortunately, they are right we've had over to there. implement more stringent entry procedures wah, due to some wah, problems wah, with wah, the wah, local norms. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Let's go, bitch. Where are they? It's nobody's. <laughs> <coughs> uh, excuse me. All right. While well, her slow ass is walking over there, I'm gonna blow my nose really quick. I'm good. <laughs> wow, I was stuffier than I thought. <coughs> Alright, so here's the Hall of Attainment. Wow, now I just feel bleh, stuffy. This is where all the apprentices stay, basically. Now I'll show you this is your room, I'm pretty sure. You're going to be sharing space with I know, this one? Yeah, this one. Who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This you can take that soul gem because uh, it's your room. Also, let's try and be considerate those clothes in there are worth something, but I'm not gonna bother now, with them. Let's go to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. Azura in the box. Ooh, ice raised teeth and void salts. It's all worth a decent amount. Lydia, get the fuck out of the way of the woman. She's trying to show us around the place, and you're just all in her grills. She's like, WTF, is this thing doing in my grills? And I'm like, I, honestly, I don't know. She's just a stupid face. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed Uh, one second, I need to re-clear my nose once again. Just 
Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. <coughs> okay, all right, I'm done. I promise. <coughs> wow. Hey guys, thanks for watching this episode of the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. If you want to watch the next or previous episodes, those will be annotated on the top. If you want to go to the playlist of the other character types, those will be annotated on the bottom. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.